Um, today I, I filmed this look. I used the um, All I See Is Magic palette from Colourpop um, as well as the Dusk Till Dawn set. And if you want to see how exactly I did it, keep on watching. So I just got an order in from Colourpop from their um, Thanksgiving Christmas sale. It's a really large box, even though I didn't get that much. Look how big it is. Anyway, so I thought, I was like, hey, I got a shit ton of eyeshadows. Why don't I do a first impressions video? And then I'm like, yeah, that sounds good. So that's what I'm going to do. I've got some really cool things here that are actually got swatches of on my Instagram. This is the dusk till dawn set which is six super shock shadows they're all ultra glitters we have new magic goodish half light star girl baby kins and sleigh bells this one is such is my favorite color because it's like a purple if you look at my swatches it's like a purple with a green gold shift but it looks really like green in the actual like component so I love it. I think I'm going to be using the shade Stargirl today. I have a look kind of in mind. Pretty basic look, you know. I also got the All I See Is Magic palette, which looks like this. I think they're all new shadows except for this one, which is now in Zen and Top Notch. But yeah, this is... What that looks like I again have some swatches on Instagram if you want to go check that out I should have a link for it I then got two of the supernova what are they called supernova shadows in walk of fame and moonlit that's what they look like again swatches on my Instagram but they're really pretty they're, they're like a liquid foiled shadow. They're kind of they're kind of like the, the steel ones, but more foily. And then I have two super shock shadows, one in fluffy, which is a holiday edition one, which is an ultra glitter, surprise surprise, and then a my little pony shadow, which is another ultra glitter in the shade posy, which I'm definitely going to have to get a backup of cuz it is gorgeous. I did my full face before in a video that is already up. It is my go-to foundation slash base routine. So if you want to check that out, I'll have a pop-up or link here. And um, yeah, let's get on with it. I already have my lid primed and ready to go. Okay, so I'm going to go in with the shade... I think this is called Big Spoon. So I'm just going to dust that all over the lid. This doesn't have a mirror. Not in, not overly impressed. This has a little bit of sparkle in it, but not noticeable. Not like a noticeable amount, you know. And nothing went on my eyelid. Maybe that's just the colour. Okay. It's like a pinky peachy colour. I don't know how well it's coming up on camera. It's nice. And you can't really see any of the glitter. Or if you can, like, I'm not mad at it. So. Next, I think I'm going to go in with the shade Teacup. Which is this shade right here. It's like a dusted lilac -y mauve sort of colour. I'm just kind of, kind of repeat what I just did but a little bit more concentrated up in the crease. So then I'm going to take this Kylie Cosmetics large fluffy brush. And I'm just going to buff that out. I might use a little bit of this color, which I think is Imperial. 
and then just like just tiny bits and this color which I think is tinsel town but it might not be maybe it's pitter patter but I'm gonna take that on the fluffier brush so I'm just gonna mix those two together so I'm just gonna try and deepen that yeah boy now I'm just gonna take this matte white color pop shade called full zip and then just kind of go because I took this up a little far just kind of backtrack it a little bit that's my little little trick of the day and I'll do it to this eye too because it's kind of winged out a little far it just diffuses the color back whatever color your skin tone is what I kind of and because I'm white as hell I'm just gonna add a little bit more purple to this one there we go this is getting nice and then just buff it away I really like this where it's gone so far actually if the camera could focus I'm gonna put this color down which is 1111 and then I'm gonna mix in a little bit of this color which is something special put it on my brush and then dampen it to hopefully give it a bit of a foiled effect I'm gonna put on star girl and then on top I'm gonna put a bit of goodish on which is a um purple with gold tint to it it looks wet It just looks wet. Then just a smidgen of the other shade on top, goodish, which looks a little bit like this. Going back in with the All I See Is Magic, I'm going to take these two shades underneath my lash line. The MAC 2 something or other pencil brush. I might put a little bit of this pinky shimmery shade because it's got like a bit of shimmer on the inner corner with a bit of now and zen I'm gonna take some mascara I, as always the benefit they're real anyway um, I think I'm gonna take one wish which is a mini from Kylie's matte set Alright guys, so that is my look with the All I See Is Magic and the Dust Till Dawn shadows from Colourpop. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you in the next one.